that was a flashback as 54 year old Mike Tyson returned to the ring on Saturday night for an exhibition fight against 51 year old Roy Jones Jr. They lasted for the full eight rounds and the fight ended in a draw despite most people thinking that Tyson definitely won. So what was Mike Tyson's secret you might be wondering. He also lost 100 pounds. Can you imagine wow. the boxing legend admitted that he had smoked pot prior to the fight? I don't know about that. It was sponsored by Weed Maps, so I wonder if that was like <laughs> some sort of like a promotion because of that, Lindsay. I don't know, but I watched the fight. I felt like I was 10 years old all over again. I thought it was amazing, and the mutual respect that they had for one another I thought was incredible, too. Did you watch it? Yeah, I think that obviously everybody thinks that Tyson probably won, but because they both did it there in their 50s, it was something that was just nostalgic for everybody to watch. And um, I don't know about Mike Tyson smoking weed before the fight. I know that they were trying to convince me that that's actually a thing that happened, but I don't imagine anybody having more energy after they get high. It's just right. confusing. Lindsay, yeah. he does a podcast called Hot Boxing. Okay, what do you think that's about? <laughs> Delivering pizzas? He does say that he smokes every day. Yes. You know, he gave up cocaine three years ago, but he says every single day he likes to smoke. Uh, but wow, it was so cool to see them fight, right? It was nice. It was, he had those mo yeah. old moments of old Tyson. But I was actually sad to hear this because he stopped smoking. He smoked everything when he was training, so I didn't know that he started smoking again. But a lot of people, it relaxes them for him, obviously. I have a lot of friends who do jujitsu, which is like trying to choke each other out, and they smoke before they start start rolling because it calms them that down. Makes if sense. I if it doesn't make sense no, to me. No, it does. I, listen, I've gotten in a ring before. I was going to say, Sam, did Vegas. you smoke before no, your exhibition fight? No, but I've fight? never been more. There's me fighting in Las Vegas. There's 5,000 people watching. It was terrifying. And I have never in my life been more terrified. I did not sleep for weeks up until that fight, even though I trained for three months for it. It was the most um, nerve-wracking Moment or moment. Not looking I back say, on a, do you life. wish you had? Because there was some, a concussion, a, a, bloody, a bloody nose. Bloody nose, a concussion. Right. Yeah, she was beat up pretty bad too. But yeah, it's terrifying to get in that ring. And Sam, have I'm blown away. This is like breaking news that you did a whole boxing fight. Oh, yes. Sam, I love to like, box. Am I the only one? Yeah. <laughs> I love to box. I do. But getting in that ring is the scariest thing ever. It really, really is. I was like hyperventilating as I was like marching out. Very scary.